I've been having a great time with all these fall flavored cocktails and today I have another one I'm really excited to try, so stick around. If you're a theater fan who loves a great cocktail, click that subscribe button because Broadway Barfly is the channel for you. Hello folks, Rob Dremeyer here. Welcome to Broadway Barfly. Today we're making an autumn old fashioned. Doesn't that sound good? I came across this autumn old fashioned on liquor.com where it's credited to a bartender from Kansas City named Bo Williams. It follows your pretty standard old fashioned formula with bitters, sugar, spirit, and water in the form of ice, but he does put a really unique spin on it. It starts off with three dashes of Angostura bitters, but instead of a sugar cube, it's sweetened with apple cider syrup. Apple cider syrup, apple cider syrup. <laughs> Try saying that 10 times drunk. This apple cider syrup is basically a rich, simple syrup you make with two parts brown sugar and one part apple cider. It's easy to make, but it is a little tricky because of the way the brown sugar behaves. I actually had to make it twice. The first time I left it on the heat too long, and instead of syrup, I had caramel. A really delicious apple cider caramel, but it was too thick to mix in a cocktail. My recommendation is that you leave it on the heat only as long as it takes for the brown sugar to dissolve and incorporate with the cider. And once it hits that point, turn the heat off, and as it cools, it should get to that nice syrupy consistency. And instead of rye or bourbon, it's made with aged rum. Now he calls specifically for Mount Gay. I don't have Mount Gay here, but I am breaking out my Havana Club 7 year, which I really like, so I'm hoping that'll be a great substitute. Okay, let's mix one up and see what we get. have our autumn old fashioned. Let's give it a try. Hmm. You know, I'm really surprised that you don't get more of the apple. You get the sweetness from the syrup, but when you have the syrup by itself, you can really taste the apple. I mean, it's, it's really prominent, but the rum and the bitters really overpower it. This is maybe a bit sweet for my taste, but but the rum stands up to it and it, the sweetness is not overpowering. I have to admit, I'm not really crazy about rum cocktails unless they're fruity and frozen. So, you know, I'm not gonna say this is my favorite thing ever. I think I would love to give this a try though with the apple syrup and some bourbon. That might be really good. Okay. A decent effort, maybe not my favorite thing, but even if it's not my favorite thing, it's not gonna go to waste. <laughs> so until the next time, cheers. If you enjoyed the video, why not give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends? Feel free to leave your comments and click that subscribe button because there's a lot more Broadway Barfly to come.